Hey guys, how's it going? So I hope you're all doing wonderful today. So I'm going to be doing a new series on my channel and it is called What I Like About Something. And today's topic will be about Apple products because I use them a lot. So today's video is sort of talking about what do I like about the products and yeah, I, I own quite a few of them. So I own a Apple TV, iPod, iPhone, iPad. I always wanted a Mac, I've never had a Mac, uh, I don't have an Apple Watch, I really want one, but yeah, what do I like about them? Basically, the fact that everything works, and I, you might be saying, well, that's a stupid reason to like products. No, it's not. Everything works smoothly, seamlessly, and if I do something on an iPhone, it's on my iPad. And if I do something on my iPad, it's on my iPhone, my Apple TV, and my iPod. It's on every device that I use it on, and that's the great thing about it. What do I like about them? Yeah, that's one reason. A second reason is, is that they are built so much better than regular products. When you buy an Apple product, I bought mine in the vision of it's going to last me a long time. And what do you know? It has, and it continues to shine. I have that dinosaur iPad. One sec. This dinosaur here has lasted me four years, and it's still growing strong. And so yeah, that iPad there has lasted me four years, and it's still growing strong. My third and final reason is that the warranties and Apple support is incredible. Whenever I've had a problem with my iPhone, my iPod, my iPad, I had a problem with my iPhone, I had to ship it off and then get a new one because the other one broke. Not because I broke it, it's because the construction of the phone was actually coming apart. It was really concerning, so I was like, okay, I gotta ship this off. And then I contacted them, and they were amazing about it. They did it as quickly as possible, and I received my phone back in three days. Well, like, that's pretty good. One day shipping, one day fixing, and one day returning. And I was very, very satisfied with the service at that. So that's what I like about um, Apple products, is the design and the time put into them as well um, Apple products are more expensive than other products, but I guess that's the premium you pay for a better quality quality product and There are some things that Apple has done that has made us quite upset Of course the headphone jack is now gone one thing that annoys me that I don't think I'd ever be buying the MacBook Pro is because they move they removed all of the important ports if you're video editing which is what this mac is built for where's the sd card literally you've removed it that's the most important thing that you need to do your videos because what do you do your videos on a camera what does a camera require an sd card so how does that make sense apple all oh, right you want us to buy the external a connector that goes into the thunderbolt 3 of course of course of course apple anything for you and the headphone jack i think people were very upset about that when that was sort of taken away from us, I think we kind of got very upset and very angry. Apple's always kind of been the, the company that, based on like doing things a little bit differently. They've, they've always pushed that envelope and they've always gone on the different path and gone in a different direction. They've looked at other companies and they've gone, oh, we're gonna go in this direction because we think that we're better than them and they think they are, but sometimes they're not. Sometimes they think that they can tell us that we'll be happy with something. And they think that they can tell us, this is what you want, you're gonna be happy with it. Mm, maybe. Ironically though, here's the funny thing on this. On the iPhone 7, they removed the headphone jack, but on the MacBook Pro, they keep the headphone jack. I don't know how that makes any sense. But they did that, I guess, maybe because people want to use wired headphones when they do their editing videos or whatever. They, they didn't put much logic into this this design of this MacBook. Let's just say that because if they moved all the ports and then they put a headphone jack in, how does that make any sense? This is the logic we're working with here. The, the least important thing is in the MacBook, but the most important port is not in the MacBook. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um... I hope that this inspires you to go out and buy Apple products. And if you don't like Apple products, then I'm sorry, but I'm sure you might like something that this world has to offer you. There's lots of technology. I'm sure you'll find something from Sony or Nokia or Microsoft. 
yeah, someone like that. Someone like that. Go ahead and look at their products. I'm sure you'll be happy. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. And until then, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!